Hello, I'm Jordan, uh, and I come from Mono Royal Clan. I would like to acknowledge our ancestors and their living culture. We acknowledge Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander people who, like me, are here from other countries, as well as the traditional owners of this land. I pay respect to those who educate and guide us past, present, and future. We value and appreciate Aboriginal people who live here, work here, and learn here on ancient country of the Gurangurang, Tarabalang, Gurang, and Belay peoples. My friends walk together with us. Together we listen, together we learn. We are Kelty State School. Welcome to Bundaberg 2030. We wanted to make our world recognizable as Bundaberg, so we had the post office. You can even go in and send a postcard to someone far away. This is the Bundy Bottle, the home of the Bundaberg Brewed Drinks. We tried to make it look authentic on the inside. Mr. Fleming is already using local flavours in his drinks. You can try a drink with lemon myrtle. We hope he continues to use his traditional flavours in his products. I wonder if he has talked to any elders about what options he might have. We learned about the Burnett River rocks. They were one of the longest known petroglyphs in Australia. A petroglyph is a story written in rock. In 1970, the rocks were removed and sent to heaps of different museums around the country. They feature pecs and sign and kangaroo and emu tracks. There are also oval lines and River site was an important meeting place for Garangarang, Tarabalang, Garang, and the Balai and Balai people. We hope that by 2030 the rocks are reunited in Bundaberg. We have placed an exhibit about them in our cultural centre. We hope this centre will be filled with books about the traditional ways of life of the Grand Grand, the Travelang, the Gurang and Bali people. There would also be some books about these First Nations in the present because they are a living culture. Our teacher talked to Robert, who was a Travelang man, man, working to preserve his language. We hope that elders will use this centre to share information about their culture with us. about macadamia nuts, bubble nuts and bunya nuts through videos and Google. Using, using these on our farms would help a Bundaberg become more sustainable. They can be eaten raw, roasted, boiled or even ground for flour. We watch videos showing traditional ways of eating these native foods. These are good crops because they don't need much water or chemicals to grow and thrive. Great. This will protect our rivers and our reefs. We decided that it wasn't appropriate to have wild pigs and cows roaming our area because they aren't native and they do damage to our land. I used Tinker to make these into animals that should live in our area. Did you see my koalas, magpies and kangaroos? We loved our Minecraft experience!